Thank you. Stay fresh, so that's yeah. tonight you're going to kind of do a gig as well. So yeah. yeah. If you fall over, we'll just keep yeah. Exactly. Out. <laughs> I'll try to fall on the mic. So. Yeah, I try and do that because <laughs> I mean, yeah. see the thing is, you know, you're, you're, it's just going to be you and your guitar. Yeah. Yeah. So you. Yeah. Most, most of our shows is just you. Yeah. 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 Just, just some, just some larger shows mm -hmm. where I feel that I, and also when people ask me to do like more than one hour, mm -hmm. I yeah, I bring, bring it back. And, and and what do you what do you add to it? Uh, just percussion, like two two guys doing percussion and backup vocals, yeah. shaker and congas. Nice. And then I'm not going to truly sort of uh, acoustic, I suppose. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then do do. do how does that compare? Does it, do you uh, see a big change in the songs when that kind of thing happens? Uh, no, I wouldn't say big, but, but yeah, I usually do half a set on my own and then they come in and uh, it definitely adds another dimension. Yeah. But not, not enough to kind of change the mood. Of yeah. Because the, the, yeah. it can get a bit lonely if you just stop there. You know? Actually, uh, no, I, a lot of people think that it, the lonely parts are like uh, when when you travel on your own or like yeah. when you're backstage on your own. Yeah. Uh, well, you can only on stage. Yourself. <laughs> Sorry? You don't have a band to fight with, you see, so you're saying, I'm doing yeah. it in the set list. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No one's going to argue with you? Yeah. yeah it's but cheaper I, that way, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. But, but on stage, it's not, I mean, I never reflect. It's actually really nice to be on your own because then I, I can change mm. during, um, during yes. the show, yes, also, and really good whatever. The audience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it must be, it must be a, a really nice place for you to be in now because uh, Carl was saying it's a case of people are. I'm sorry, you know, no. Carl was saying yeah, yeah. Pe people are now calling you up. Yeah, and I'm sure that's been the case for quite some time now. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. For a long time, you go, you play, and you you do yeah. what you can to get your music out. And yeah, so you have people calling you up. Going, yeah, yeah, it's do stuff. Yeah. Yeah, no, exactly. It, it's been that way since I released the album. Yes. Yeah, or at least it feels like that for me. Of course, there's people like Carl doing the, the, the initial yeah, uh, work, but, but for me it feels like people ask me to go and play in different places, and which is nice because I, I don't, I never felt that I was, I don't like promoting myself. No, it's not your job. And, uh, it's not my my style and I, I don't like playing for people that don't want me to play you yes. know what I mean yeah, like, uh, yeah. that would be there because I want, they want to be there yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so that's and that's more and more the case I'm sure the audience yeah. sizes yeah. Yeah. are starting yeah. to yeah. start trying to reflect that yeah, yeah. yeah. the people in the crowd singing along to your songs and you're going yeah because these are new songs to you I mean these yeah. songs that you've been living with for yeah. 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 yeah yeah literally yeah, yeah. <laughs> And you're going to be doing a lot of tours, um, or you're doing a lot of the summer festivals as well. Yeah. So yeah. Are you playing for performance? Yeah. 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 I'll be going up for that. Okay. So, yeah. Cool. Yeah. yeah, it's uh, it's a couple of festivals then uh, Australia, mm -hmm. New Zealand, and then the States, mm -hmm. and all all independents mm -hmm. in the sense that have you the records been picked up by by small passionate labels that are. Yeah, to mark. yeah. I mean, uh, Mute is the biggest one. Mute is releasing it in the states, but they're, they're still independent. Also. Like, yes, yes. So they have that. And I always have the, that uh, aim to, to work with independent labels. That's important, yeah, because I think they share the same passion. Yeah, yeah. That you do. Yeah. It's a yeah. case of if it translates into, I suppose that your career is dictated by by the ability to be able to do this full time and to be able yeah. to do this for a living. Yeah. So yeah. there is that point that you rely on the labels to yeah. look after you and yeah. promote you, perhaps in maybe a traditional way, yeah. in order to get people to listen because there's so much music out there yeah. Yeah. that you're competing against. Yeah. But also, like, major labels tend to, I mean, they need records to sell huge amounts. Numbers, yeah. And uh, so it it's more like either or, I mean, but uh, if you do it on smaller labels, it, it's got to spend less money and more, more time with you. you more time, yeah, and, yeah, exactly. I'm right. I can. Are you enjoying this part of it though? You know, with when it does become, in a way, you are now, you know, you have a schedule that is probably full for the rest of the year. 
Is yeah. It, is it not? Is it not? Yeah, it's a bit like a job. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's been you know, like a job for quite a while now. Yeah, but um, yeah, it's it's a fun job, mm -hmm. and also I. Uh, what do you call it? Um, uh, 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 I lost the thread. That's okay. <laughs> no, no, that's fine. Yeah. That's, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's demanding. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it takes it. But, but it's uh, always from different from tour to tour. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, some tours are really mellow and mm -hmm. like the states was alright, you know, like just one show a day, maybe one interview a day. So yeah, a lot of free time, a lot of people around you. And, yeah. Uh, while others are like a lot of traveling. And, yeah. Is it interesting to see how how people relate to your music in different places? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So you wanna do it? I'll swap. Okay. Use it too. Yeah. 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 But is it interesting for you to see how people res respond in the same way? Because obviously yeah. they're buying the music, but yeah, they yeah. all have their different. No, uh, no, it's it's actually not not so different at all. It's it's really interested. really it's really really interesting to see. I mean, at first I thought this would be only a kind of a Swedish. Or, uh, I thought it was really like a product of, of uh, what, like. The Swedish culture in a way. Buy into it, yeah. Yeah, and because uh, the Heartbeats cover was so such. I mean, the, the original version was uh, kind of an underground hit in Sweden. So I thought that was one of the main reasons why it had gone, like, why it was successful. Uh, and now I, I'm saying that it's it's working in many different. How did that happen? Kind of music? Because, as you say, Sweden was home, and, and that's where it, it starts. But yeah. when did when did territories beyond Sweden start to take notice? Of, yeah, how did that happen? Did somebody take the record? Um, yeah, I mean, uh, so this this record label in Sweden, Imperial, these two guys, they they released it only in Sweden first, and like for a whole year, I was only touring in Sweden and. I, I was. They were getting feedback from from people in the states and UK, but only like you yes. know music yeah, yes. enthusiasts. Yes. Uh, and and when uh, well, they they eventually started looking up licensing labels. And uh, it just takes one, and then, and then the next one goes. Oh, okay. Well, if that one's interested, yeah. there must be something there. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. So yeah. it's been like. Step by step, which is good though. It's gradual. Yeah, it hasn't yeah. been one yeah, no. on one go. And also, uh, I, I think it would have been possible at all to do it with a small label like, like them. Yes. It, to, if you want to do it, every, like whole world is actually you can't. Yeah, they're not. Yeah. They're not equipped to do it. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. And it's nice too that people like how oh, again they take it away from the material and say that we want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you actually, if you think about it, you probably have. Hundred people working for you. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> at any yeah. given point. Yeah, too, yeah, exactly. Which is, which is, which is yeah. interesting. Yeah, and it, I mean, with the, with the fact that it's it's now being so well received, does it uh, does it surprise you that that it that it has become this underground phenomenon? Uh, yeah, I mean, it, it surprised me quite a lot in the in the beginning. Yes. Like in, in Sweden, and since then, it's it surprised me when. The UK picked it up, and, and now I kind of feel like it's kind of the way it works. It's, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. We do a Sweden's best gift secret until recently. Yeah. Sorry, I'm sure yeah. Sweden likes to own you. Yeah. You know, in the sense that yeah, you know you're there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, it happens in South Africa too when, it, when an artist here yeah. mm. does well in another territory. Yeah. yeah. And all of a sudden they go, oh, oh no, no, he's ours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and for years you yeah. know, yeah. these people are nothing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, yeah, America picks up on you and they go, oh, yeah, yeah. 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 You don't care. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no, but uh, in Sweden it's been more like uh, they 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 cared when it came out and then. Uh, it was kind of like 
forgotten because I didn't crowd anything in Sweden. Yeah. And now, now it's uh, picking up in Sweden again, okay. just because of the things that's happening in the UK. Yeah. yeah. And then obviously like the Sony and stuff like yeah. that, which is really universal campaign. Yeah. Because I mean, it's here, and it's I'm yeah. sure the whole of Europe. Yeah. And yeah, yeah, probably America as well. No, not, not, not America. No, you don't need America. Sorry? I said if you had America as well, then... Yeah. Because the thing is, you're only one person. Yeah. And you can only be in so many places. Yeah. yeah. At, you know, at any given time. No. So it's, I think that must be one of the biggest problems for the answer to when Sweden gave you your career. Yeah, yeah. Now, the rest of the world wants you, but you don't want to leave Sweden behind, mm -hmm. but you can't be mm -hmm. there and in yeah. America yeah. and in South Africa. Yeah, you know. yeah no, it's, uh, it's kind of like concentrating on different places. Yeah. Different What's the most and exciting place for you? Uh, I mean, I, I feel like the UK has been quite an interesting. This is a difficult market. Well. Yeah, 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 and, uh, and uh, you know, I've come from playing. Uh, I remember the first show was like uh, a place that was 25 people or yeah. 30, and and that was packed. To go to uh, really big theaters, like 3,000 people. Wow. And, and amazing. And just to see the, the, the change from the progress. Yeah, and it's been like every time I've come back, it's been slightly bigger. Do you, sometimes, do you sometimes stop and go, this is a little unreal? You know, that it's yeah, uh, yeah. Like when I played in Hammersmith Apollo, mm, which is uh, it's lovely. Yeah, yeah, lovely. Really lovely, yeah. but great. Amazingly, mm. uh, I felt it was really big. Yeah. And the audience is a bit too. Okay. Yeah, very yeah, receptive. Yeah. Yeah. I think that was kind of a, uh, yeah. Um, it's nice in a way because if you think about it, you're not doing it the traditional way where you've got this entourage of 10,000 people, you know, and then someone dressing you and somebody doing this and that. It's really a small team of people yeah. that can have the same, in some cases, maybe even bigger result yeah. than yeah. if you had. You know, yeah, and to pick up the track, you had, yeah. you know, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. stuff. Although at the, that tour, I had my own. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> selling out. This yeah, but it was uh, actually more yeah, economical. No, no back <laughs> but it was uh, more economical than to, mm. to do it that way. Yeah. yeah, so it wasn't. And, and and do you find that this is a time where you just that you can only focus on? Performing and doing this kind of thing, or do you find it quite a creative time? Sorry, is it quite quite a creative time for you? Do you feel um, inspired by the places that you go to? Um, yeah, to some extent. It, and as you said earlier, it's, uh, it's it's been feeling like a job for a while now. Yeah, and uh, I I kind of I see it as a temporary thing. Yeah, with, um, the whole touring part. I, I'm, I've never been good at being. To, uh, never been able to ride on tours, or, so kind of needs to be temporary. So I need to go back and do that. Go yeah, back, yeah, quiet space, yeah, yeah, away from everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but uh, but it's inspiring many other ways, and like just the fact that you're in different cities, meeting different people. And but there, there, there definitely seems to be a, I think even with artists like yourself, and there's, there are other artists like you, female artists and, and other artists that are I'm doing the same kind of thing. But it seems to have a lot of artists are stripping it down and what people are buying into is the stuff that is the less there is, the more they're buying into because mm -hmm. you know, I mean if you if there's a kid we now just this past weekend had an Australian artist Missy Higgins who was out from okay. Australia okay. doing a, a piano based acoustic yeah. setup which again people like you the majority of people didn't weren't aware of you by the time she left. Mm. There was this this interest, yeah, yeah, because again, it's not, it's not this mass, mm. you know, mass market where you mm. know that mm. Niles Barkley is the biggest thing, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, in, yeah, in yeah. at the moment. And you understand how that operates, but the respect that other people have for, you know, on a original artists and the guys who can get onto a stage, yeah, with yeah. just a guitar, yeah, right? yeah, and have three thousand people eating out of it, yeah, yeah, that's an art, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's, and and and. And inspirations of the artists that you that you that, um, that inspire you that you that you would go to their uh, uh, I guess Cat Power is still mm. a big inspiration. Uh, I 
But yeah, people like Sheila and Danger Mouse, I think they're doing yeah, great music. And, uh, Are these people that you'd like to maybe work with at some stage, do you think? If there's yeah, an opportunity I mean, there? Yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, why not? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, I've done like, yeah, just recorded guitar for, for like hip hop producers mm -hmm. and that, like that sort of stuff. But it's completely away from what you do? I actually, yeah, I mean, the result. It's yes, because it's not, not completely different, but, but uh, it's. I mean, the, gu the guitar that I've given away to, to the guitar riffs that I've given away to, that's one that's really similar to my own, so. It's just a little bit so, yeah. yeah. But, uh, but I, yeah, it's, it's really nice to, to, to work out of context, like, it's out of your own context. Would you say that Veneers is an album that is step one? And the next step will be something very different. No, no, nice. no. Uh, uh, because I feel that I can do those other really different stuff in other uh, yeah, the other places. Yeah. yeah, behind like yeah. my my like my band Junip mm -hmm. or or collaboration mm -hmm. like with Zero Seven mm -hmm. and uh, and but yeah, that was great. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but but so so I feel like I can the solo stuff I can keep keep it focused to just the guitar. And for the most part, I mean, it's, it's, it is accessible stuff. Um, yeah. You know, you, you're not trying to challenge your audience too much in the sense no. you, you know, um, I suppose the easiest comparison is someone like Tom York yeah. doing that as a Razor project. It's something that is clearly not a, it doesn't have a very strong commercial mm. appeal. Whether it works or whether it doesn't is another you know they put it out. Yeah, yeah. And if it works, great. Yeah. It doesn't. Yeah. And the, the irony is when you don't worry yeah. about that, it works. Yeah, and yeah, it, yeah. Is that is that sort of the approach when you're writing songs that you you're not listening, you're not writing for anyone in particular. Mm -hmm. You're not thinking, oh, this is going to sound good on the radio. Yeah, yeah. Or yeah. Gee, this would make a good video. You're just no. writing. Uh, sort of. I mean, I. I'll when I write at, as now with a data phone and, and and when and I I record on the data phone and listen to it and uh, so I kind of write for myself mm. because I, I when I listen to it and feel good about it that's yeah. when I know that, that it's all right yeah yeah and uh, so you like so your, you like your own music uh, you could say so I, I mean it, mm. it's kind of a job thing like listening to myself it's not that I you know, go around and like. Would you buy your record? Uh, no, probably not. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Uh, I mean, uh, no, I, I don't know how to put it, but yeah. But uh, if I if I wasn't myself, then yes. yeah, yeah, probably. Yeah, uh, yeah. But uh, but it's. Uh, yeah, I tried to listen to it as. as uh, yeah, it's a bit strange situation, but I, I record and I listen to it myself, yeah. and whenever it feels so right, that yeah. is when I know that it's that, can, I, that can, I can that now pick it on the album. Can you pick out your singles? Can you go that that one? Will work no, that's that actually. Uh, a, uh, I mean, in, in Sweden, uh, the the Joachim from the record label he picked out the process. Mm -hmm. Uh, I wasn't really sure about that, but he, but he left it up to him. Sorry? He left it up to him. Yeah, uh, I mean, yeah, in a way I provided the album and it was up to them to yeah, market it or yeah. whatever. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, and now looking back three years later, I feel that that was the right choice. Mm. Uh, and so, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I don't think I'm the best person to, because I have, I'm, I guess I'm more attached to different songs and yeah, for yeah. different reasons too. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And it's important because clearly these songs are very personal. Yeah, songs yeah. So they, in a way, there is a time that you need to build up the stockpile of your yeah. emotions. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah. You know, and, and you can't just create stuff. You know, if I said you write a song now, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get hold of it. And yeah, I need something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So the rest of the. Uh, for you, the summer 
to yep yeah it's uh, another album for the end of the year no? uh, um, I mean the schedule is short until the first of November and then I'll um, fall then I'll, sorry then you fall over that's when I'll <laughs> fall down sleep yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Take that's, the, time that's yeah. The, the plan uh, three four months cool. just to either just to regroup yeah sorry? to regroup maybe yeah. spend time yeah. with family and yeah and just hang out in Sweden and, and be cool. start yeah yeah start writing songs and it must be nice it must be comforting for you to know that when you do that you can, the pace will be different now because you're not needing to perhaps do something as quickly because yeah no no actually now. actually yeah and, uh, and also like like the UK and the States they don't they don't want another album no that's just really yeah, <laughs> just it. yeah exactly so, yeah. so that's really nice yeah Great. So, I think that's it.